The Bellagio is a resort, luxury hotel, and casino in Paradise, Nevada, located on the Las Vegas Strip. It was erected on the site of the demolished Dunes Hotel and Casino and is owned by the Blackstone Group and operated by MGM Resorts International. In Las Vegas, everyone has a tale, even if it's merely a hazy recollection. Whether it's about a wild weekend, a celebrity sighting, or a glimpse into casino history, one thing is certain. The stories become a part of everyone who visits or lives here. And it's that sense of ownership that keeps people coming back, keeps the mystery alive, and ensures that Las Vegas remains one of the world's most well-known cities. The Bellagio Hotel in Las Vegas is a dream, with huge rooms and captivating vistas. But there are some startling truths about the property. Las Vegas, Nevada is known as the world's marriage capital, Sin City, and the city that never sleeps. It's no wonder that Vegas attracts more than 40 million tourists each year with its vibrant performances, flashing lights, and opulent casinos. There's one destination that stands out among all the luxurious resorts, artsy bars, and romantic restaurants, Bellagio Hotel and Casino. The Bellagio, designed by Steve Wynn and run by MGM Resorts, is the epitome of grandeur. Bellagio provides an unforgettable experience from spacious suites to breathtaking vistas. Despite the fact that the Bellagio Resort is well known around the world, there are 10 startling facts about it that few people are aware of. Number 10. The Bellagio Fountains Seeing the Bellagio Fountains is one of the most gorgeous things to do in Vegas. The daily shows are among the most photographed events in Las Vegas, attracting millions of visitors. Surprisingly, the Bellagio Fountains require 22 million gallons of water which is stored in the 8.5-acre lake. The Fountains of Bellagio, arguably one of Las Vegas' most beloved and well-known attractions, have appeared in several films, performances, and events, as well as in virtually all Las Vegas-related B-roll footage taken in recent years. The coordinated and fascinating water shows are a must-see for both visitors and locals, and a lot of work goes into making sure that each of the 10,000 annual shows runs well. Musicians and actors from all over the world flock to the Bellagio Resort. Surprisingly, Ocean's Eleven is one of the most well-known films shot there. Perhaps it was back then, when George Clooney fell in love with Bellagio, that he was inspired to purchase a property on the beaches of Lake Como in Italy. Number 9. The Pearl of Lake Como The name of the Bellagio Resort is without a doubt one of its most intriguing aspects. Bellagio is named after Bellagio, Italy, one of Lake Como's jewels. Bellagio is noted for its elegance and creative ambiance with its colorful villas, cobblestone walkways, and breathtaking views. Simply stunning. Number 8. Las Vegas Remake, Steve Wynn The unofficial ruler of Las Vegas has been dubbed Steve Wynn. His economic empire, however, now derives the majority of its wealth from China. The billionaire casino entrepreneur transformed the legendary Las Vegas Strip by building towering resorts such as the Bellagio, Treasure Island, and Mirage. However, his company's operations in the city generated less than a fifth of its overall income in the most recent financial quarter. Bellagio is synonymous with opulence, with its luxurious accommodations and spectacular shows. Bellagio was built at a cost of $1.6 billion, making it the most expensive site ever built at the time. Steve Wynn altered Vegas with his groundbreaking initiative, which began in 1996. The Bellagio Fountains have become iconic, and they are among the most photographed sites in the United States. Number 7. An Unofficial Art Museum Inside Bellagio, there is no inspired hotel art. Original artwork by less-known artists and lesser-known artisans may be found around every corner, sometimes side-by-side. Side. Not only will a visit to Michelin-starred restaurant Picasso reward you with a memorable dinner, but you will also be able to gaze at 22 authentic Picasso paintings and other notable masterpieces, the Bellagio Gallery of Fine Art is one of Las Vegas' major cultural destinations, with constantly changing exhibitions that expose both tourists and locals to outstanding works and artists. Picasso, Fabergé, Warhol, and Liechtenstein collections have all been featured in previous exhibitions. Exceptional pieces from Las Vegas collectors, as well as Japanese art, have been featured in previous displays. Although this gallery is modest, the shows are carefully organized to include well-known artists and intriguing collections. Number 6. The Quiet Birth of Legends Room Are you ready to go all-in on a high-stakes poker game? Las Vegas is one of the best gaming cities in the world, and it attracts a wide range of strange characters. Nonetheless, Bellagio is home to Bobby's Room, one of the most exclusive poker rooms ever. Bobby Baldwin, the 1978 World Series of Poker main event winner and president and CEO of MGM Resorts City Center, is honored in this room. 
To play there, you must have a $20,000 buy-in ready. The resort's high-stakes poker area, meanwhile, has undergone a major, albeit subtle, redesign. Bellagio's Poker Room, possibly one of the most well-known card halls, hosts some major tournaments, including the World Series of Poker. Number 5. Suites and Facilities Are a Maze Bellagio is opulently large. According to Casino City Times, Bellagio has 3,950 rooms, making it the 14th largest hotel in the world. The spa tower is 33 stories tall and includes 915 rooms. In addition, the Bellagio offers more than 100,000 square feet of gaming space. Bellagio fans will recall the magnificent stairway that once graced the hotel's iconic conservatory. Its removal, on the other hand, barely registered on our radars. It could be because, despite its grandeur, the staircase appeared to be unused. Or maybe it's because its substitute, a quartz quarry obelisk, seems right at home. Bellagio's bathrooms are spacious, with marble vanities, lit cosmetic mirrors, and large soaking tubs. Bellagio offers its own line of bath products, as well as some handy extras such as razors, sewing kits, and cotton pads. The Wi-Fi here is excellent, and it's included in the higher-than-average daily resort fee of $44. Number 4. Plants and Colors in Millions The Bellagio's 14,000-square-foot conservatory and botanical gardens are one of the resort's most beautiful features. During the Christmas season, the conservatory gets around 30,000 visitors every day. It's no surprise that the conservatory employs a staff of 125 employees. In addition, if you gaze behind the Bellagio's facade, you'll discover a patch of green growing on the resort's rooftop. The Bellagio includes a rooftop garden that provides fresh herbs to several of Vegas's restaurants. Number 3. The Wedding Chapel Holding Capacity Are you looking for a romantic wedding location? The Terrazza di Sogno at Bellagio, which hosts over 600 wedding parties overlooking the fountains, which are timed to begin with the couple's first kiss, is one of Bellagio's most popular wedding locations. Kelly Ripa and Mark Consuelos, Richard Gere and Cindy Crawford, Angelina Jolie and Billy Bob Thornton, and Bruce Willis and Demi Moore are just a few of the famous couples that married in Vegas. The Bellagio in particular is well known. Did you know that more than 600 weddings take place there each year? Number 2. Overcrowding at the Bellagio Without a doubt, Bellagio is spectacular. The Bellagio Buffet, in particular, is one of the greatest places to go for a unique dining experience at a reasonable cost. You can easily please your taste buds with everything from spicy seafood to luscious meats. However, the throng can be intimidating, so let's hope your stomach can hold out a little longer. Number 1. The Bellagio's Global Expansion It's no surprise that MGM is expanding the Bellagio internationally, given its popularity and success. In Shanghai, China, there is a non-gaming Bellagio Resort, and the business plans to add another in Dubai in 2021. However, the old Bellagio's grandeur, with its surreal fountains and water displays, is unrivaled. That's all we had for you today. Enjoyed the show? Please subscribe to our channel by clicking on the subscribe button. Bye, see you next time.